Hello, C Dub again. Just a real quick video. I thought I would share uh, with everybody a little something I got going on right now. Let me turn the camera around here so you can see. What I have right there is three pork shoulder roast that I'm smoking. And on top of them, or over them, I should say, on the rack, is some steelhead trout fillets that I'm smoking. I'm doing this smoke um, for the volunteers down at the thrift store that is ran by the church that I attend. It's called Renewed Thrift Store. And the money that is raised, all the profits that are made through Renewed Thrift Store, are used to go to the local food bank to help feed the hungry of the area. So we're just kind of doing a little volunteer appreciation uh, tomorrow uh, because this is going to take me about six hours to cook them. I want to close the lid here because if it's not closed, if you're seeing or if you're looking, you're not cooking. So I want to close the lid down now so that the smoke can get in there and I can bring the temperature back up to where it's supposed to be. I like, I like to smoke at... Uh, 250 degrees if at all possible 250 to 270 and I'll cook these roasts till they're about 205 degrees internal temperature now like like I was saying um, we're, we're, we're doing this I'm, I'm helping out the director of renewed thrift store it's kind of a, a volunteer appreciation type lunch tomorrow that they're gonna have so I'm, I'm cooking them right now um, at between 250 and 275, excuse me, 250 and, two, and 270 degrees uh, for about six hours so that it's nice and slow and it'll be super tender. I'm going to make pulled pork out of it for them and I hope they enjoy it. I did spare ribs a while back and uh, this time I thought pulled pork would be a good uh, lunchtime for them. Now I'll, I'll cook it today and then I'll shred it and after it cools down I'll refrigerate it and then tomorrow I'll reheat it or I'll probably wait till tomorrow to reheat it and then shred it so it re retains its moisture. And I'll get it down to them about 11, 11.30 tomorrow morning so they can have it for lunch. Uh, just a little sneak peek on what's going on for the folks down there tomorrow. And um, I hope you all enjoyed it. And you have a great day and I'll talk to you later. Don't forget if you liked the video give me a thumbs up. And come back again, subscribe and like and make a comment. Uh, I'll have a woodworking video up again in a couple of more days. You have a great day, and I hope you all have good health. This is C-Dub saying goodbye.